Hello friends, welcome. Now we are okay with the users. So we have the CRUD. Also we have a search here for the table and we can show and hide some fields. Now let's start and work with the system management and first with countries. Uh, yeah, right now we have empty and so let's open the VS code. And first of all, inside the admin, I'm going to create a new directory for the countries. So let's say countries here and then this one. So the users index, I'm going to save as the admin countries index. Okay, click OK. And now, yeah, here is the index. Just instead of users, I'm going to say countries here. And also the link to create a new country. So our admin countries create and say here new country. And let's close this. And then we need the table for the countries. So instead of users, we can say table for countries and a cell for the action and then the link for the admin countries. Edit, pass in here the country and uh, let's select all here and change in one go. So country like this, just in the route, we need to say countries. Admin countries destroy, pass in the country and admin countries edit, pass in the country here, edit and delete. And here delete the country, okay. We are good with the table and with the index page. Now what we need is to open the country controller. So country controller and on the index method we need to return the view. So let's return the view which is admin countries index and also we need to pass here countries but for that we need to create the countries table so let's open the terminal here i'm going to say artisan make table and the name of the table is going to be country like this very good and here now let's use the countries table class okay so the same we have for the user controller on the user controller here we added the users from table in here we are going to add the countries and now let's save this and let's open the countries table on the authorize we have or and also the configure. Now I'm going to open the users because it's going to be something similar. And I uh, had the comment because he said uh, I'm not using the query builder, but here is the query builder. So let's copy that and let's navigate inside the countries and on the four method, I'm going to paste that in. We need to make some changes. First, let's import all of them. So import the allowed, import the collection from the Illuminate support collection, import the query builder. And now we are going to add the global search. And here we are on the countries and for the countries, let's open the table plus and see we have the country code and the name and we are going to search for the name and also for the country code like this and remove the others and return the query builder for not user class but for country I import the country up here, app models country 
So return the query builder for country. The default sort is going to be the ID and the allow sort is going to be the ID, the name and the country code. So let's copy that and paste it here and then remove or if you want you can leave the created ad but I'm going to remove and the allowed filters I'm going to do the same so just copy and paste it here okay that's it for the for method now let's go and see the configure because it's going to be almost the same so I'm going to copy this and paste it in here and now we have the with global search for the ID name and the country code so let's copy this and paste it here and remove the others we have the column ID which is going to be sortable and column name is going to be sortable and also the country code is going to be sortable and it's not going to be hidden by default because we have only the ID name and the country code I'm going to remove the others here and also we have the action because we are going to add the we have the links there so we have the links the edit and delete and I think we are good we don't have any you any uh, country yet so let's remove also this one and now if we go and see here if I refresh yeah is there are no items to show we have the link here to create new country and the search good now let's work with the, the create a new country so I'm going to close this okay now here on the create method we need to return the view which is going to show the form so return the view admin countries create so let's say create this here and I'm going to save now let's go and create that page I'm going to save this inside the admin countries okay and let's say new country here and the, the action is going to be admin countries store good then for the country we have the country code and let's say here code and also the name and that's it and remove everything else let's save and let's see now if I open here go to the new country yeah we have the code and the name then let's go to the store method and I'm going to create a new request for the store country request so let's say artisan make a request and it's going to be store country request and also let's create the update country request good here now let's use that the store country request dollars and request and let's open change the authorized to be true and here we need to validate the code the country code which is going to be required it's going to be a string and it's going to be maximum of uh, three characters okay and then we have the name which is going to be required is going to be a string and let's say max 
of uh, 100 like this and let's save now let's close this on the store method we are going to say country create create and pass the request validated here like this and let's save now let's go on the user controller and here i'm going to copy this let's save some time and paste it right here change the route to be not admin users but admin countries and also we need to import the split change here to say country created i think we are okay and before we try let's see on the models country yeah we have empty here so let's uh, add protected fillable to be an array with country code and also the name and that's it now let's save and let's see if we try so let's refresh with the say us first and united states let's say submit and here we have country created and here is the country new one i'm going to say uk and united kingdom submit and let's say one more time for the gr and i'm going to say agrees here submit and yeah okay friends so that's it about this video we have the table we can create new country and display here so we can search for example search for just us yeah here we are or uk we can also search by name so uh dates like this and yeah very good reset now if you like don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video all the best and see you in the next one thank you very much